guys how are we today steve back again with another little mini collectible that um i've been doing lately so in the theme of the aliens and the proton pack here is the pke meter uh, that was part of the uh, ghostbusters franchise and um part of these collectibles like the jaws and the uh, and the other two i just mentioned so here we have um Definitely assigned to the right franchise, the original Boys Ghostbusters, and um, this might be similar to what we had before. I wasn't really impressed with the Proton Pack, to be honest. It looked a bit, a bit poor, but um, hopefully this would be a little bit better. And uh, as I said before, they're not that expensive, so um, it's nice if they do come out. Like the Xenomorph was really good, and the Jaws, I really like that too. Um, but this, let's see what we get and see if it's worth the little bit of money that we paid for it so like before we get uh, inside the box we get a sticker book and we get the actual pke meter itself so as before i'll skip through the sticker book um it's a different kind of style of stickers that we had before they're a bit dark a little bit retro um yeah very retro and i like that yeah, this is more probably aimed at the movie than the other book um, with the Proton Pack. But these stickers I probably would use somewhere. And then we have the PKE meter. So the side is where the little uh, ears, metal ears come up. We have the front with the display. Been interested to see if that does anything. Um, and then the back, obviously the batteries have now been activated. So, okay, so I'll start it. That's cool, so it's like a sticker, but then it has a light under it. And then shines through, we have the three uh, lights underneath it. Push it again, so the green light seems to light up more. And then push again and it goes off. Now there is a back button that you push and the, uh, the metal ears pop up, so Let's try that again. So we press the front, and then I'm going to push the back, and that pops up. And then you see the lights to the left and the right side, and the thing goes a bit more mental as that comes out to indicate there is a ghost nearby, and it slows down a bit. So there is uh, different versions of speed once the side uh, pop open. So if I push the front again, it will go off, and I push it again. It activates that kind of hyper mode, as in like danger coming. Um, so if you see the red and the orange light goes on first, and you push it again, the green light comes on. Um, I'm not sure if that's going faster because of the green light, but uh, actually I quite like this one. So they both go down at the same time when you push them, and they lock down like that. Now one thing I will say is at the back, I had to push that three or four times to get activated. So you, so it doesn't activate when you push it. Uh, the front button needs to be on to do something. So I guess if you uh, wanted to show people, you start off with the front going, oh look, no ghosts, no ghosts. And then you activate it by pushing the back button and then off it pops. And then it starts to activate a little bit more. Pin more animated. Yeah, that was much better than the um, the Proton Pack. I really like that. So I'll give that a bit of a thumbs up. But let me know what you think of these little collectibles because I'm always interested in hearing what you have to say. So keep on liking, keep subscribing, um, and I will be back soon with lots more. Take care. Bye-bye.